Some students in Pasco County now have to find other ways to get to school this year because the district eliminated school buses for kids living within a two mile radius of their school. It's known as courtesy busing. Our Heather Lee shows us the fight that one parent is now taking to the state legislature to bring it back. There's no sidewalks, there's flooding in the areas, there's no lighting, there's blind turns like you can see on our road. And this is the new route Jennifer Resnick's son will be taking when he rides his bike to Gulf Middle School. I've taken him, we've gone now several times up and down the road to find the safest route with the most sidewalks, the most well lit. But she doesn't know if that will be enough to keep him safe. In January, the Pasco County School District decided to do away with courtesy busing, which are buses provided to kids that live within two miles of their school. Officials say it was in response to the district's ongoing bus driver shortage. They have told me it's not legislated. We don't have to was exactly what I was told by the assistant superintendent. That's what the district told us too. Quote, state law requires school districts provide transportation to students who live two plus miles outside their zone school or attend a school with hazardous walking conditions. And even though Resnick believes her son's route is hazardous, she says district officials won't come out to look for themselves. I actually had um, a gentleman who's running for state representative come out and we walked the route here on Washington Street and he actually almost got hit by a car. Really? Just in that short five minute walk. Resnick says she's not only reaching out to folks running for office, but elected officials hoping to change that law. The situation is so dire and just the law so antiquated that, you know, looking at changing that law is what we're going to go forward doing. So I have been speaking to a number of state representatives and state senators, many of whom have expressed interest in introducing this as a bill for the next legis legislative session. We asked the district if they had a response to that idea, but they did not respond to that question. Heather Lee, ABC Action News.